What's up everyone, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Blaze Black Illumination Arc. In the last episode, we took on the second gym leader and unfortunately faced a casualty of Athena, which honestly I was expecting a casualty, but uh, I was kind of hoping somewhere that it wouldn't have happened. So these are our survivors. And these are the death, the deads. I'm gonna just go ahead and move, like, get us a little organized. I could possibly do that off screen, maybe. I'm just go ahead and move you right there. Okay. So we got. So this is the squad that we have left remaining. We basically have well, one, uh, two, three, four, five, six flying Pokemon. It's gonna be fun. Okay, but today we're gonna possibly, I guess, do a bit of grinding. And also, uh, set forth the, uh, oh, we can go in here. The battle Company. Fuck it, let's take it on right now. We got time, and also we get uh, something good out of it. Be extra careful. I will be extra careful. Okay. Yeah, we don't have to press the button. You can press the button if you want to be a little bit more realistic. Me at 2011, when I made a, when I made one of my first YouTube videos back in the day. But yeah, we gotta fight these hoes. And it should be fun. Okay, I wonder what level these guys are. Cause, okay, we're definitely fine on the levels. Because I was about to do a bit of grinding, actually, before I started this episode. For one look at the levels, I was thinking... Oh! Fuck. Okay, good. I disabled the cheat. I really thought I had experience codes on. That would not be fun! A little bit of big fucking whoops to me. This woman has so much water. Water up the butt, but oh well. So I'm gonna go ahead and put meat into this. Yeah, I'm gonna put around like level 25, level 27. I gotta go ahead and. I might do a bit of grinding off screen for the next gym. And. Well. That was a lot of experience. No. Uh, okay. Oh, Zobo hasn't been given has been given much chance to, to shine. Oh well, thanks for calling mine. Not sure we're gonna need it, but okay. Oh, bulk up. Well, thanks. Might not also use it too. But someone definitely needs some experience. It's the lowest level of the bunch right now. And we definitely need all of our Pokemon to be evenly leveled. We are a normal type user, I guess. I literally have no idea why this boy has Seed Bomb. I was just grinding and it just was like, hey, he wants to learn Seed Bomb. I'm like, okay, it's a good move for now, but. It can also be used on ground type, water type, rock type, and I think that's it. But yeah, um, I know I already said this in the video, but I apologize for my uh, YouTube schedule being completely whack. 
Curlio. Okay, that's different. That actually would sick if we had a fucking Curlio. I think he's a randomizer. If I get through this alive, I might try doing a bit, a few more. At least for the games, I can easily hack the Pokemon in. Definitely same with the 30 Pokemon rule. Because I do not want to lose... I know you could do like a team with... About like... With, I guess uh, 12 Pokemon. But honestly... I could possibly die. <laughs> and with this amount of Pokemon, I have a fighting chance. You missed again. Oh. Are you retarded right now? Thank you, holy Definitely risking it so badly over here. This guy could get a crit big time and just knock Zopo down and we have another casualty. Which I'm feeling I'm feeling we're gonna get casually every gym battle. We did in the first one. I think we're a little overpowered too, which Do I care? Not really. Okay, I definitely think I accidentally put the thing on. One minute. Okay, don't bother me. I'm just being retarded. Honestly, well, I'm never being retarded. Don't, don't get offended when I use the word retarded. Or maybe I should just stop using it just to not trigger people. I, I don't mean it in that way. I just mean it to me when I'm being dumb. I don't mean to offend. That's the last thing I want on this channel. It's to offend people, which I apologize. I expect defense. No, thank you. So yeah, continuing on with the uh, content of the series, uh, the Spinda looks very happy. Oh my god. This did do too much damage. I think I want to stay in. Uh, I'll get Skyforge out, why the hell not? I don't want to play Skyrim. You know what, I take my controller, my, uh, my Switch controller, and I, and I hold my Xbox controller, I'm just like, this is fucking, this is fucking bulky and large as shit, I'm just like, what the hell? Skyrim is pretty powerful. But not when crap like this happens. Get this shit out of my subreddit. There we go. Holy crap. What the fuck? You were supposed to die. Okay. Okay, now you're just a little bit of a cunt. Die, please. Thank you very much. You're now dead. I could have... I got that. Okay. We... Have spin top to do with this. Huh, I'm feeling a little exhausted. I think I, I did I did upload I did make a platinum video beforehand. So and also I've gotten up a little bit late, but I did have a good night's rest, I guess. Counter I'm not risking nearly dying just to near just to basically kill someone. A shuckle. I got a shuckle buckle. Eh, 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 I'll go home now. Rollful. Shuckle has like the highest defense stat. But shit in other stats. Like seriously. His attack stat is crap, his speed is low, his special attack is low. 
His other his other stats, his defense stats, are what makes Shaka the man that he is right now. Or woman, depending on his gender. There we go. You lost. Give me those give me those coins. The cash money. I'm better at Pokemon Battles than I am at work. I'm better at video games than work. And actually my wife said that my manager said just the fucking manager's nickname. My manager told me that I'm one of the best work cooks. I'm just like Oh Well that that's that's nice to know. I'm like, uh Thanks. How did you said it? No, I'm not gonna let go of my head and think I'm very happy because I suck. She makes me she, she makes me uh, go by her Tim Hortons a lot, but she pays for it though. <laughs> oh man, I got a story to tell y'all. So the other night, the other day, yesterday actually, um, I was working the night shift. So I came in around 4 o'clock, well probably a little bit earlier I guess, and my manager takes me aside and asks me to get her something from Tim Hortons. She's like, get yourself something at, at Tim's too because why the hell not? And so I'm like, well okay, I mean, sure, why not, we're not, that, we're not technically that busy. So we do it. So I do it. But like two minutes go by, I come back. I'm just taking off my coat, getting my stuff back on. And next thing I know, the fucking fire alarm is going off. I'm like, oh sh At first I thought I was like, am I tripping balls over here? Am I going back to high school? Because I haven't heard it since high school. And I just, I'm just like, oh my lord. So we all just rush outside. I put my coat on, and then I just go by the office before I leave. I like grab my 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 uh, drink. There wasn't no fire, so we're fine. And just we just run out. We tell all the customers to leave. Turns out this um, this kid who can't be any younger than three. He accidentally tripped it, and oh my god, I felt so bad for that little kid. Oh my god, he he looked so sad and embarrassed. He just he was just his his dad held him up, um, and the kid was just he just buried his face in his dad's shoulder. I feel like he might have been crying. Oh my god, I feel so bad for that kid. It wasn't his fault, it was an accident. We're all good. We at least got like a, I guess a 15 minute break. So that that was on the on the plus side. So uh we're all good. We're all good. We had to wait for the fire firefighters to come. I even documented on Snapchat. Well not really documented. I just recorded a couple bits and pieces of it. On Snapchat because I was like, this is a little bit hilarious. <laughs> we got a fire alarm going off. We're all just chilling, just having a chat. Me and my manager are just there sipping. Uh... Oh, I was supposed to switch. My bad. So me and my manager are just there sipping on our hot drinks. A couple of my coworkers are smoking. You know the dorm. That is not going to be very fun. I am going to go ahead and I'm going to swap to Yeetus. I should nickname him Yeetus, not just Yeet. Yeetus. I feel like this is definitely taking over the entire episode, so whoops. But oh well. No, not Le I thought I clicked the button. I thought I clicked the button. The button that's right there. You shitbag. At least he had some health back. Anyway, they come, they uh, sell everything, 
And we just go home. Nope, I'm kidding. We, uh, oh, Gus Koblenz. Nice. We just, uh, eat, eat back and just get back to work. Which is, I just, I finish my drink. Fortunately, I didn't win anything. Alright, the dream. I feel like I already got skill blinds for a little while. So that's like part one of this place. We still got another place which probably has more trainers and it's probably gonna take me the other 15 minutes. Let's get the janitor to deal with too. I'm kinda hungry. Hyper Potion. Oh man, this actually like brings me back to when I first started watching uh, Game Boy Luke. He was doing a Pokemon Blaze Black Nuzlocke series, Randomizer Nuzlocke. That's like what first got me into his series. And then you just like start start uh, playing uh, some games that uh, I... Some Pokemon games that I wanted to play for myself. So I was like, I'll just like stop watching it for a bit. I did miss, I didn't... I do miss his uh, prison series. Two, two years ago, when I started that series, him doing a Nuzlocke of it made me want to have a go at it. And you know what? I was just like, screw it. I'm going to have a go of it. First, I knew like the first couple, I think the first nine or so episodes, because I watched the Let's Play. Then I just did my own thing, rewatched what we did, rinse and repeat. Then he just stopped uploading it for some. Oh, fuck. I'm out of here. Nope, too spooky for me, boys. They just stopped uploading it for some reason. I think I was getting tired of it or something. Oh, that sucks. It was a good game. I think, uh... There's another game that I want to do. Like, replay, because I'm thinking of starting a Let's Replay series. I, uh, if you wanted to hear more about it, go to my latest, uh, Pokemon, um, fucking... Uh, Platinum series. The Stark Mountain episode. I'll probably have that uh, up before that if I think about it. And yeah. That was a good game. Remember he did uh, Pokemon Glaze? Oh, no. Yeah, he did Pokemon Glaze and I was like, we only did like the first half. That first half he beat in the Elite Four, but there was another half. The Johto region. The, uh, I think the Orange Isle Islands, and then the Red. Yeah. He definitely had a few more things he could have done. Then he just started, uh, I forget why he stopped doing that, doing that series. Maybe because, um, Sun and Moon was right around the corner. I he did, uh, no, he did a, uh, hmm. a Sun and Moon, uh, a Pokemon Sun Randomizer, and I was like, that same year, I think. I think it was, or was it the next year? I forget, I need to go check. Damn, that was ages ago. I remember that shit. Trench. My Pokemon's getting a little bit owned over here, but we're doing fine, nevertheless. I could definitely do this off screen, but... Again, I had to get the fucking wall. I feel like I should definitely get some sneezes. I definitely want to play the Mario Switch. My brother started getting me into... My brother wanted me to get into a Fortnite. And, um, one of my friend's house. We made supper. was pretty good. Um... Me and my brother, we helped out a bit, and we just played our switches. My brother bought a switch, too. Mime Jr. dot, and another dot. Oh, shit. You're a psychic type. This isn't ins- Okay, well, luckily, this is a physical type move. So we should be okay on that, that part. I don't want Yeet to die. Yeet's good. Okay, we have, I think, three more uh, bitches left to fight. I'm gonna go ahead and use this potion. There we go. I'm 
I'm gonna go ahead and put V up front. Yeah. Uh, what do you got? Let me. Why am I? What, what am I helping you for? I'm definitely gonna try knock out some bids this weekend. Possibly not. I'm not gonna do it on uh, Saturday. Mostly because me my probably cousin not gonna be in the state of mind to do it. Plus, I'll probably be too tired. I do it throughout the day, but. I'm actually gonna be doing stuff. Like, I gotta go get stuff. I need to buy some snacks. I get my game in bungees. I gotta buy some snacks. I need to buy some breakfast. This really time I breakfast food now. Shit. It's not good. Oh, well. And also, I'm gonna go ahead and buy myself a copy of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I'm gonna play that. I'm gonna have a nice time. I'm gonna enjoy it. Oh wait, why am I switching? What a psychic type. I can one hit own your ass. Okay. We're doing pretty well. My team is pretty solid, I have to say. Of course, I will be expecting deaths. I just hope I don't get... I kind of want Sloth and G to stay alive. Uh, Spin Top and Zopo. I definitely assume what my, like, final team can consist of Charizard or Tyranitar. That stuff, but uh, I probably won't have a Tyranitar on the team until like probably like, a bit further when we start getting to the 50s. I think right when we fight Skyla, I think that's my when I might start putting him on the team. Of course, I will grind the fuck out of it. I'm getting a bit hungry. I have no food. And we got one more trainer, and then we got a janitor boy to fight. So I'm gonna guess it's gonna take us around eight minutes. So this might be a thirty-minute episode, depending. Really. And that is not the right time down there. I just load up a safe state. Level twenty-five. There we go. Iron defenses. Not bad. Oh, definitely nice. Call it well. Probably one of my coworkers' favorite Pokemon is, I guess, Candle Candle Starter is a uh, Bulbasaur because I was working a morning shift. I Shift one morning. Oh, surf. Nice. I was working a morning shift one night. One day. One more. One. I was working a morning shift one night. Yeah, that, that totally makes a lot of sense. Nice. God damn it. I was working a morning shift one morning. And I was on a break with this one other girl. I don't know what to think about it. Oh, we have a mudkip too. Forgot about that. I'm gonna get two. I'm gonna team. Rep died. But, uh, he, uh, came in. You scheduled on night shift, but came in, like an hour too early. Because he decides to show up early for the balls. And he had a Pokemon hat on. I'm like, I'm like, Charmander's but he's like, no Bulbasaur. And she's like, no Squirrelism. And, and, like, I don't say anything. Cause, but, like, at the moment, I'm like, really? I was like, you were, you were like the, the person I least expect to play games. She says she plays a lot of Red Dead Redemption. And I'm like, hi. I, I, and then she jokes about me playing Mario Kart. 
because I made one Snapchat story of me and my brother, my friend, playing fucking Mario Kart. And now she goes off saying that I play Mario Kart all the damn time. And let me just say, it gets annoying because every time I'm on a ship with her, she brings up, I'm just like, I'm going home. Like, grow the fuck up, please. Like, literally, there's like some, there's like a bunch of people in my workplace that seriously need to grow the fuck up. Especially these, the two girls, that girl included. Because, I definitely made a bitch story, a bitching story on another video, which probably won't come out until like way fucking later. But, uh, in that video, I just explained that this one girl who's, who's 18 at the time, who's like 18 right now, she just decides to go ahead and hate this one co-worker for absolutely no fucking reason, and make up claims I cannot even, not even, like, comprehend. It is not nice, she, and, and also, to make matters worse, the other day, I was in a, I'm in a, I'm in a group chat with her and a couple other employees. So she goes ahead and says that working an hour with him gave her a pimple, which is fucking the most childish bullshitness I have ever heard in my entire fucking life. You have honestly have to be so fucking retardedly childish. To be able to do something and say something like that. And clearly that's not the case. See. There's no way pimples can spread like genetics. And, or, I don't know, like genetics. There's no way can sp pimples can spread to other people like that. Can you like stop please bro? I'm trying to get this episode done over. I don't know how long. How long I'm really care. But yeah, I know that same uh, girl I'm talking about like earlier. It's a little bit crazy. She uh, actually today when I was at work and uh, I was waiting for these uh, three cookers to come up, and she's like, "Tell me to work." Holy fuck! She's like, "Don't stand around. Like, do something." And you're just like, "Okay, number one." We have a night shift cook that is basically cooking for me while I'm just chucking shit in the cooker. And I'm just like, bruh, I'm waiting for shit to go down. Do you not see this? It's like, Jesus fucking Christ. I'm like, I have my brother's like, you have some weird ass fucking colors. I'm like, you know what? I do. And all those EXP shares. They're money, because if I'm ever going to have a Pokemon low level in a party, I'm going to do that in the end of an episode, so then I can spend the next, so I can spend, like, probably like an hour grinding him up to, like, level 3,000. Well, that took a lot longer than I thought. I think I'd be spending nearly 30 minutes inside that place just to gain an average two or three levels. Oh well, knocked it out, got a little bit stronger in the progress, so I'm going to go ahead and end uh, up the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Pokemon, um, Blaze Black, Elimination Lock. In the next episode, we're going to go ahead and continue on, possibly unlock the means to face the next gym leader. So thanks for watching, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!